Bonjour, je m'appelle Dr. Tin et bienvenue à French 1311. Chapitre 4, leçon 6. Aujourd'hui, nous allons étudier le verbe venir. Le verbe venir au présent. Hello, my name is Dr. Tin and welcome to French 1311. Chapter 4, Lesson 6. Today we are going to study the verb venir. Venir, which in English means to come. To come. Ça va? Très bien. Ok. Page. Page 113. Page 118. 113. 118. Le verbe venir. Le verbe venir. Ok. To come. In the present tense. Ok. We have another verb. Revenir. 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 Which means to come back from. Ok. To come back. Or to return. It also has... A synonym which is an ER verb, rentrer, rentrer. Sometimes rentrer will have a slight difference in meaning. It will mean to come back home from maybe school or work. So to come back home, rentrer is a regular ER verb conjugated like any regular it. ER verb, ça va? Like étudier, right? Whereas venir and revenir are irregular verbs. Just like aller, être, avoir, and faire. Okay? So, venir, an irregular verb, should be studied just like être. Right? Or faire. Or avoir. Or aller. Which we learned in our very previous lesson. On its own terms. It is an irregular verb. Just like aller. Okay. So we have the pronouns here. Je. Tu. Il. Elle. En. Nous. Vous. Il. Elle. Je viens, tu viens, il, elle, en vient avec T. Vous tirez ça. Nous venons, vous venez, il, elle, viennent. So, je viens, tu viens, il, elle, en vient avec T. Vous faites nous venons, vous venez, il, elle, viennent. Irregular verb should be stated on its own terms. It does not follow like rentrer, ER verb, in irregular pattern, right? It should be learned on its own terms. Je viens, tu viens, il, elle, en vient avec T. Nous venons, vous venez, il, elle, viennent. Okay. To show movement from. The preposition de is normally used with the verb venir or revenir. Okay, when it's like that, the preposition de will stand in front of what is being used and what is that the person is coming back from. It was stand alone. If it's a town, right? De was stand alone. So here, il vient de Paris pour notre fête. Il vient de Paris pour notre fête. See that de was stand alone in front of the town. All right? Now here, il revient d'un concert. D'un concert. 
Here it is because the has come into contact with a, which begins with a vowel. So you drop the first vowel and then you put your apostrophe here. So, il revient d'un concert de, but because de comes into contact with a vowel, you will drop the E in front of de, and then you put your apostrophe here to become de apostrophe. Okay, ça va? Okay, so you can use rentrer in the place of Revenir, right, with a slight difference. You know, rentrer is ER very regular. So you draw the ER and you know what to do, right? So vous rentrez de, the same de, right? You could have used <coughs> revenir and said vous revenez de votre travail. It doesn't really sound very well. So the normal verb to use to mean to come back home from, right, will be rentrer. So, are you coming back home from work? Vous rentrez de votre travail? You're coming back from work, right? Vous rentrez de votre travail? De will stand like in front of the town in front of the place you are coming from, right? Use in front of the indefinite article, right? It will stand alone. Ça va? Très bien. But sometimes there is contraction when de, the preposition de, combines with the definite article le, right? When it's like that, when it's like that, De plus lo is contracted to become du. De, de plus the definite article lo will contract to become du, de. Tu reviens du cinéma. Tu reviens du cinéma. Tu, re, tu reviens du cinéma. Okay, here is le cinéma. And the de coming into contact with the definite article le will contract into du, du. Okay, you don't do the contraction when de is placed in front of the definite article la, the, the female, right? The feminine form of the definite article la. There's no contraction there. So, vous. Revenez de la banque because it's la banque, right? Banque is feminine. When it's used with de, it will stand like that, de la. When it is used here, if we were saying you are coming back from a bank, then it would have been June, right? You put it in here and then this changes, concept changes to bank, right? Okay, but here it does not change. La will stand alone with the and become, it will, they will become the la. Here there's a contraction with le. Here there's no contraction. Vous revenez de la banque. You're coming back from the bank. When it comes into de, comes into contact with an apostrophe, it is also not changed. It will stand like that with the definite article and apostrophe. No change there. Nous revenons de l'hôpital. Nous revenons de l'hôpital. No change there. There is, however, a contraction, a change when the, the preposition from, comes into contact with le. There, it will become de, 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 d-e-s. 
Elles reviennent des cours. They are coming back from classes. They are coming back from classes. Okay. Now, the is also used with venir or revenir. To me, to come back from when it's used from, when it's used with revenir, and when it's used with venir means to come from. Okay. Now, here it is used. De, the preposition de is used with venir or revenir to mean from and is used with geographical locations, towns, right, countries, continents, provinces, and states. Now, the use of de standing alone will depend on the location being a town. Right, the preposition contracting itself de from de to du will depend on also the location being a masculine country. Ça va? Or de will also depend on whether the country is plural. Right? When it is used alone, then the country is feminine or it is a feminine continent. Ça va? Très bien. So, when it's used with de or the apostrophe in front of a geographical location, that location is either a town like Paris or Montreal or a female country like La France or l'Allemagne or a female continent like l'Afrique. L'Afrique, they are féminin, féminin or l'Asie, right? You will use the alone without any combination, without any contraction. So, in front of a city, right? On vient de Paris. We come from Paris. We are coming from Paris. It can mean two things. We come from Paris or we are coming from Paris, right? On vient de Paris. They come from Paris, right? The on can mean they, it can mean we. Okay. Okay. Il vient de Montréal. They come from Montreal, right? In front of a city, de, de, does not combine, does not contract. It stands alone in front of a city. The same thing. It was stand alone, de, the preposition de, used with Venir or revenir was stand alone when used in front of a feminine country. That means the country will have la, right, or an apostrophe in front of it. Feminine countries, feminine countries. Ça va? Which means those countries will have is at the end of them in French. Except Mexique. Très bien. Okay. So, use with feminine countries. You don't use la with de. De will stand alone. Okay. So, nous venons de France. We come from France or we are coming from France. The same thing. Right? With two meanings. But de, de preposition will not combine with la. La will disappear. Okay? Nous venons de France. Vous revenez d'Allemagne. 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 You know, it's just this. And then Allemagne beginning with a. And then you drop in the e and put in your apostrophe there. 
Ça va? Très bien. The same thing here. Right? So, the will stand alone in front of feminine countries. Right? France, Allemagne, of feminine continent. Afrique. So, nous venons de France. Vous revenez d'Allemagne. You are coming back from Germany. You are coming back from Germany. Okay? Il vient d'Afrique. Il vient d'Afrique. Alright? The location is a feminine location in French. Right? But la will not be used. Right? The L apostrophe will not be used. Just de. But de will come into contact with a. And then you will drop the E, the E, and put your apostrophe. Okay? When, however, the country, the geographical location is masculine, is le, 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 le. Right? You know, Mexico is an exception to the rule where when the countries have E, and in them, in their spelling, those countries are feminine. Mexique is the exception. So it's le Mexique. Brésil is, you see it doesn't have E, so it's le Brésil. When the location used with the preposition de is masculine, a masculine country. Then, de will combine with le, right, to become du, contraction there. Okay, the same thing with le merci. De will combine with le to become du. So, you will say, elle vient du Brésil. She comes from Brazil, right? Or she is coming from movement, right? Brazil. Il vient du Mexique. They are coming from Mexico or they come from Mexico. The DE, right? The will combine with le, le, and become the contraction du, du. In front of the geographical location, what is masculine with plural countries like les États-Unis, les États-Unis, or les Pays-Bas, les Pays-Bas, les États-Unis, right? De will combine with les to become de, de. Contraction, right? So, nous revenons des États-Unis. Nous revenons des États-Unis. We are coming back from the United States. Okay. Vous venez des Pays-Bas. You're coming from the Netherlands or you come from the Netherlands. Okay. Masculine plural countries, right? The le will combine with de, the de to become de, 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 de. So, nous revenons des États-Unis, vous venez des Pays-Bas. Ça va? Ça va bien? Très bien. Au revoir et à bientôt.